Hello, this is a very quick look at the Sony Xperia Z1 Compact. This is the full size Z1 and here's the Compact on top of it, so you can see it is much smaller, but it packs in the same technology. The Z1 Compact is about the same size as an iPhone and on the top you've got a headphone socket. Around the side you've got power button, volumes, rockers which also act as zoom and a camera button. Brilliant, love having a camera button, dedicated camera button. On the bottom is the speakers and on the left hand side you've got micro SD and SIM slot and you'll notice that these are covered like so and that's because this is a waterproof phone. You also have uh, small docking pins here. You don't actually have to open this up to charge this. What you can get is a special uh, charging point which just magnetically locks on there instead of having to have opened this up. Day to day use, this is a brilliant phone. This is really fast. It comes with loads pre-installed. Um, some you'll find useful, some you won't. The Walkman app is very nice and uh, displays things really nicely. Album app is pretty good at displaying photos. Unfortunately, it does pick up album art if you then copy your songs onto it. The camera is very good. You've got a 20 megapixel camera on the back and you can change that to forward facing as well for your selfies. It comes with a number of different modes. As you see here, AR effects is a very interesting one. You can pick a particular effect and it will, in real time, render this on top of whatever you're looking at. And you can record this. Uh, it's not essential, but it's a nice bit of fun. Sony have done a great job on power management with this phone. You've got various modes, low battery mode, location-based Wi-Fi is brilliant, so it knows when I'm home and when I'm at work. And if I'm at neither of those places, it switches the Wi-Fi off automatically. Stamina mode shuts down uh, things like Wi-Fi, Bluetooth to make sure you've got a bit of power left. And overall, I found the battery life to be excellent. I can go a couple of days without needing to fully charge it. Um, at the end of the day, I've got maybe 60-70% left. Web browsing on this is great. It, even though it's not the biggest screen you can get, it's still really nice and pleasant to use. Um, this is a 4G phone. I'm just waiting for my 4G SIM at the moment. But even on 3G, it's pretty rapid and on Wi-Fi it's, it's brilliant as well. It's actually uh, quite a bit nippier than my previous phone which was a HTC One X. Overall I've been really happy with this phone. The size is perfect. I didn't want a massive phone. I thought the Z1 was a little bit too big. The size is brilliant. It looks great. Uh, the back does seem to be a little bit prone to scratching if you're not careful. Uh, it's got loads of power. It's really fast, really easy to use, waterproof. It's, this is one of the best phones I've ever used. If you want to know more, I'll put a link to the Amazon product page below. When you click through, you'll see my review there. Please vote it up. Thank you.